Chelsea have had a lot of fun making these videos with you and with our crew, of course. Now we got all this produce. What are we going to do with this? Well, Jan, according to the National Garden Bureau, it's the year of the salad green. So I think we should let's make, make a, a salad. salad. All right. I think we should have some greens for a base. What do you think? I think that's a great idea. Some endive, maybe? Some endive. Give it a couple of good handfuls. All right. No, this is escarole. I think we should put some of that in. Me too. And to go with some color for that, I think we should use this radicchio. Add a little bitterness and some great purple antioxidants. Are we going to use a little bit of a citrusy dressing then, maybe? I think that would balance oh, it well. That'd be great. How about a few radishes? Mmm. Bring up the heat. A little and, crunch? Yeah. Now to capture some of that citrus dressing, I think we need some extra texture. So how about some Savoy cabbage? Savoy is great. Yeah. In the salad. I love it. I'll add two handfuls. Great. What well, else do we have over here? We've got some pointed headed cabbage. Ooh. This is nice stuff. It's sweet. really nice and sweet. And it's got a great yeah. crunch and it holds up well to some dressing too. Perfect. And then for some extra color, we sprinkle in a little red. What do you All think? All right, great. I'll meet your red and add some purple kale. Yay. Mm, this is looking good. What do you think about exotic vegetables? How about a little fennel? Ooh, that anise. A little bit of anise flavor. Yeah. Not too much, but a little bit. That's a nice little surprise. Mm. How does tomato go with anise? Mediterranean, it's got to be good. Find out. Add some slices to it while I'm getting these cut up. What else would you like to add from your pile? Well, you know, you know, I'm from Northern Europe, so we're throwing a little carrot. Great, perfect. And let me see. <gasps> Beet greens. I almost forgot about the beet greens. You have color, you have texture, and you have health. Great. I think uh, a few Asian accents, perhaps? Yeah. It's like little, healthy croutons. Little pak choy. Mm. Cut that up in there. That'll be great. Nice and fresh, crunchy. Maybe a little few sesame seeds over the top of that. That'd be nice. And then, Perfect. you know, just to round it out, we got this leafy cabbage from England. Oh, tell me about it. It's got a little bit along the lines of a colored maybe. Okay. It doesn't make a head, but it's got some really tender greens. Yeah. They're fairly strong flavored, you know, really meant more for cooking. Okay. But you know, we're going to give them a good strong dressing. Yeah. And we're going to add some of this stuff to it. What would we'll we see call how this? It's a uh, spring green cabbage. Okay, like a verve? Yep. A verve. Okay. Verve is the, is the name of the variety. Yep. So it's uh, really interesting. I think uh, we're almost done. Chelsea, I'm just going to add a little bit of this stuff. Yeah, let's add just a couple for, more of our favorites. Just for freshness. Up here. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep. How many people are coming over for dinner? Well, one, two, three, four. We have a handful. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. We'll sprinkle gonna a few have to more keep on going. there. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Well, right. I think we're on our way to a beautiful salad. We can invite our friends over and enjoy the year of the salad greens. Right. Great. Great.